I didn't want to build my bed so much that I just never go to bed. <laughs> Wait, what are you sleeping on? I, I sleep what, just on- Just a mattress? Yeah, just a mattress. <laughs> what? Do you actually- Wait, Wait, Wait so you really? don't have a bed frame at home? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I actually, cause, cause I, I actually like it, right? Because you can get those like, you can, it's so ghetto. You can get the fucking, uh, the low frames. Yeah. The ones that are like literally on the floor. Isn't it also like really bad for your floor to just have like a mattress on it? Is it? Does, doesn't it get like moldy or whatever? I, 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 God, Isn't that the whole reason? Has you looked underneath your mattress? Isn't that the whole reason for a bed frame? Is to stop like the floor from molding or something? Can, no, no, no. What if you Google this? No, yeah, we, no, we, Google we, this? We, do, we do have like a bed frame, but it's like one of those literally floor bed, bed frames where it's like- you so put it's it, just a plank of wood on there. Yeah, so it's, it's basically just a plank of wood <laughs> yeah, on the floor. Saying, you can get the, the floor bed frame. Yeah, and, so and, yeah, and yeah. the reason for it was because we, we when we moved in, yeah. uh, we just like slept on a futon at Connors for like a week. Mm. And at first Sydney was just like, why would why would we sleep on the floor? Peasants sleep on the floor. And me being the Asian, like I, every time I go like to Thailand, I'd always sleep on the floor at yeah. my grandma's place. Mm. And I'm just like, there's something comforting about sleeping on the floor. And I don't know what it is, but, I sleep, I, I just realized that whenever we'd go to like onsens or ryokans or whatever, you'd sleep on the futon floors, mm. futon mattresses, and you just get the best night of sleep you have in your life. And I don't know I, I what it is. I think it might be because like the tatami or the floor or whatever it is you're you're sleeping on, the, the hard surface, yeah. it like flattens your back out. Yeah. So I guess that just like naturally gives you better sleep or something. Yeah. I, but I agree, like I, I get the best sleep in a futon. Yeah. So like I, I we just yes. we just we just decided why not just fucking sleep on the floor. Peak God. soda for me is soda with ice, right? Because you have to like you pour it on the ice. So watered the, down soda. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do like a little bit watered down soda because like for me like Coke out of a can, it's so fizzy that you just can't. I don't understand how. <laughs> It is, it is. It's just, I, it's just throat made out of paper. Like, like, <laughs> oh, oh, it's, oh, it hurts. It's fine, it's just fucking gassy as fuck. Like soda, a drink is meant to re be refreshing. You can't me, tell me, you can't tell me after you down like a fully fizzy soda, it doesn't have to be Coke, just any any soda. Cause mm. I don't drink Coke anymore either. Yeah. But like after you like open it, just you hear that like sound, you drink it down and then you do that massive fucking yeah, the burp. burp. The burp is very nice. It's like the best fucking feeling on you the know, planet. Normally I'm always willing to try and understand your point, John, but I, I <laughs> honestly, I don't even know where this is coming from. Like, this is weird. This is this is coming from I've just- never, I've, I've never drank a soda and been like, damn, I wish this was less carbonated. <laughs> <laughs> I wish this I was think that Because like to me, <laughs> A, a drink is meant to be refreshing, right? Yeah. I, that's that's why that's why we drink, <laughs> but right? The carbonation, it's, meant, it's meant to but be the refreshing. The carbonation is supposed it's to be refreshing. refreshing. The carbonation is not refreshing. It's pretty refreshing. It's not refreshing. Well, I can that's tell you like the what? sugared out flat ass soda flat? is definitely not refreshing. It's not, no, no, it's <laughs> like, I don't coke? like flat soda. I do not like flat soda. Flat soda is awful, yeah. right? It's just when it's like on ice, you get like you get a bit of the fizz out, and that's like the perfect amount of carbonation in a soda. That's that's why. If if I drink soda, if I want to be if I want it to be refreshing, it needs a little bit of ice just to get a bit Something of that carbonation out. Like perfect amount. Too long. <laughs> That's what it sounds like. Who taught you this? <laughs> this man wants to hydrate no matter what. That the reason great. I haven't watched Lord of the Rings is okay. I have watched the first movie. Yeah. Fell asleep. Thought it was boring. Never came back. Really? How old, how old are you? When did it, when did it come out? Lord of the the, oh the first God. one, Fellowship of the Ring, came yeah. out in like mid two thousands, right? Did it? I think it was. Yeah, wait, yeah. So like two thousand and three or something. Yeah, right? something like so that. So I remember my cousin watching it, um, and right, he was well, like, yeah. "You got to was it? Oh one, oh, oh one. one. So I must have been holy like, shit. It's a twenty year old movie. So I think I was shit. about like thirteen, fourteen when I attempted to watch it, yeah. and I don't know, like how that's could a like the prime time though. I feel. I, so this is gonna sound weird from like coming from the isekai guy. I just I just don't find fantasy all that interesting. What the fuck? That's all you fucking talk about. That's all you talk about. Okay, 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 okay. Watch it now. You okay. like fantasy now. Bring go back, back and, wait, 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 Go wait, wait, back wait. and watch it now. Yeah. Anime fantasy, yeah. I fucking slap, I fucking fuck with that. Real life fantasy, get this shit out of my face. Oh my God, what a weeb. <laughs> what a fucking weeb. Bro, go watch it. Oh. Actually give it a shot. If it's it doesn't amazing. have a hot enemy titties in an isekai world, I don't want it. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate the Is honesty. the main character overpowered? No, Frodo is like, Fr Frodo can't do shit. He just- all, That's all he why it's so good. That's why it's good because he, he, he fights through all of these like insanely <laughs> impossible to survive oh, situations shit, with the power of friendship, bro. God, every single movie movie has just amazing scenes in it. Dude, like, Sam, best waifu. I'm just saying right now, he's best waifu, dude. He I, supports Frodo to, from start to finish. What's your man. favorite Lord of the Rings movie, Joey? Probably the third one. 
See, this is what I mean. You can say any single, any one of those movies is the best movie. Mm. And I, I, I'm like, that's totally fair. Like every single yeah. movie is great. All three movies are fantastic. Fuck, dude. Yeah. I've actually seen the original trilogy a lot of times because mm. someone's always got it on in the background. Yeah, someone's always watching it at some fucking family, um, family gathering or of something course, was like playing at Christmas. Yeah. I don't know why, but someone's always watching it. So I've seen it so many fucking times and I, I kind of find it like just boring. I don't, I, mm. it's just a very, standard movie with like uh, it's 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 just a what's original about star wars nowadays well like, nowadays it's not because again like very much like matrix it's just yeah. been copied to shit yeah, it's, it's kind of just like the matrix to yeah. me where it's just it to me it's just boring now it's just mm. a very normal standard movie and it's just mm. like yeah luke goes on a hero's journey yeah. and darth vader is the villain and yada 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 well, that's fuck mean, darth vader yeah You're like like what's 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 scary about someone having asthma yeah. like, like fucking <laughs> also i have asthma also, does that make me fucking scary no domestic girlfriend fucking awoke something in me man. <laughs> like you this 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 single show basically dictated my hentai taste from like, so, I, there, so, there's so, me so, before so. domestic girlfriend and there's me after domestic girlfriend. So one. wait, if I'm correct, is yeah. it there's a guy and there's a teacher? Yeah. And a okay, sister. Okay. okay, okay, so. That's correct, is that so, correct? Okay, is so that... let, me, let, me, let me break it down for you, okay? So there's this guy who has, who's in love with his teacher, right? Yeah. And one day he just randomly goes up to a meetup and uh, he meets another girl at a karaoke. Uh, what's what's it called in a car, like a bar, bar? bar? No, oh. what's 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 the event Speedy. where a mixer. a mixer? A mixer. Thank you, Sydney. You know, so he goes to a mixer and he meets this girl, and this girl for some reason wants to lose her virginity because she just at the age where she just like fuck it, I got nothing better to do. Doesn't the anime literally open with them like yeah? After the anime sex. literally opens the, with them just after okay. sex, right? Yeah. And so he sleeps with this girl. And then it's who he's just met, and then they say goodbye, um, and then he goes home, and then he finds out that his dad's getting remarried, and then he meets the pe the family that he's getting like his dad's getting married to, uh -huh. and it turns out that the mother of or his future mother-in-law, uh, or no, his future stepmother, uh, she has two daughters. One is the girl he slept with, and the other is the teacher he's in love with. And that is the premise where is of the, this where, is where is the, where is the incest sign when we need this is it. Literally, this is this is incest gone, and <laughs> this is just like this is like what if we made all porn categories into one? This is what it sounds basically, like. Basically, this is like basically com combine every porn. Where are the laundry machines? Okay. Get four of them in this house. <laughs> okay, so like I will fully admit that the, the, that the concepts. I mean, yeah, this is this is a hentai plot. Okay, this, this, this is, is this is your this is this is your kisses. This. Uh, <laughs> Let's be no, real. No, it is. It's, 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 it is. It's better than the kiss. It but is. People were like, when we did the anime three by three, people were like, why Why is the domestic girlfriend anime not on there? Mm. It's because I actually read the manga. I think it's a good fucking manga you, and I will defend it till the day I fucking die. Would you say it's a masterpiece? I would say, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> it's a masterpiece in my heart. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, All because right, like, I, I understand. Because I like, understand. What, what happens is like, this masterpiece is short for masturbating piece, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> but like, okay, what, what I love about this manga is that it takes the most, like, it's, it, the situation is a complete car wreck and it just turns to a car wreck, to a train wreck, to a fucking nuclear holocaust. It, like, the, the, <laughs> like, the layers of how complicated the situation get just yeah. just get stacked on top of each other but what what offsets this is that it's actually a really well written manga it's like a, a lot of Hold thought on, you're being very oxymoronic right now okay okay <laughs> okay because a lot of thought was really put into the characters so the characters uh -huh. actually seem really realistic and mm. you can kind of like empathize with them right mm. what's what you can't relate to is the fucking situation that they're in. So you put really- I hope not. You put like, you put actual like realistic characters or mm. well-written characters into this really fucking trashy, wacky situation. And it's such, it's like a juxtaposition of just, you're actually invested in these characters, but also the stuff that's happening is so wild mm. that you just want to keep reading just to see what happens next. It's like a soap opera, but the characters are actually really like, you're, you're really, really invested in these characters. 
I, no, I, I, I just couldn't get to that point with the anime, honestly. No, I was no, no, like, so what's you... more of a battle, this or Kingdom? What's more of an epic battle? <laughs> <laughs> it's two different battles, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> which is the bigger battle? Uh, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I don't know which one's more five head, man. Well, uh, one of them is like, you're physically getting hurt no, because... battle. The other is like chipping away at your brain. Yeah. <laughs> okay, because, because like the, the anime is the really, okay, the, what the anime did is that it just took all the trashy moments in the manga mm. without any of the character moments and just put them and just Speed ran it. So right. it, made a, mm. it made a bad porno. Huh? It made a bad porno. <laughs> yeah, but it made a bad porno. Okay. It, 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 uh, I mean, what, what porno doesn't have character development? What, <laughs> well, how can I uh, get invested? Most of them. Most a good one. <laughs> <laughs> Living in Japan has made me change my opinion because before- what? <laughs> Okay, so before moving to Japan or before like moving it's out of- It's totally unrelated. Like, well, no, actually, <laughs> it's not totally unrelated because before moving to Japan or moving out of England, my favorite season was summer. Okay. Yeah. I was. I was. We discussed kid. this in the podcast before, and we were Have like, we? "Yeah." Uh, or maybe it was just yeah. like off camera. But I think it was I remember, off camera. I remember yeah. we were like talking about because I think you and I both like the winter, yeah, like yeah. much, much more. No, winter's worst season. Lots of no. Fuck off. Win winter's worst season. Maybe this should become a conversation that we have every single year. The summer turns around, and everyone's gonna be like, "You guys spoke about this <laughs> yeah. already." I'm like, "It's in my head. Shut up." <laughs> no, because like I, I didn't realize that. Uh, it's like summer wind, uh, summers in England are actually pretty good. And that's why summer was my favorite well, season. How hot right? does it get in England? It's like 25 degrees okay. Celsius. That's not summer. <laughs> yeah, but that's the thing, right? That's the thing. No, it's, no, it gets hotter than that, God. It gets hotter for like summer, one, the week. Summer, one week. The summer before we left, right? Yeah, yeah, but that one week is pure hell because UK, we don't have air conditioning. It just doesn't exist. True. In homes. Yeah, the one time I went to the UK, I, it was during that week. It's yeah. horrible because, yeah, it yeah. you know, at least in Japanese summer, it's like, oh shit, walking outside, fuck, this is, it, it's it's way worse, but you can just go in any any building anywhere, and you're like, oh, cool, just instant hot. They've got yeah. the they've got yeah they've got the AC running at full like full blast, like it's, it's good. But it's in like the a UK, it's, it's, the you, you have no escape in the UK. Yeah, it's like yeah, maybe sure. the gym has AC, the supermarket probably has it, but like that's it. Like when you go home, you're like, <laughs> put on the TV. <laughs> Ah! Yeah, because like, what do you do to cool down in the UK? Have like nine fans on you. So, so you do have fans. Yeah, but fans don't do shit. Yeah, fa fans, fans don't do shit. Fans are like- the Fans just dissipate the hot air. Fans are placebos yeah. of, of like, a, you're like, yeah, it's definitely doing something. You're like, why am I still sweating so much? Huh. Like- I It doesn't because I, it, all it is is just taking the stagnant hot air and just moving it around, right? Yeah, occasionally I just like, you go up to it, you know, I put my shirt over the fan. Yeah. And I'm like, this is true cooling. That's, that, that's, that's the best feeling. That's the only, I, I, maybe it's an, a nostalgia. <laughs> thing for me because growing up or like spending my summers in Thailand, uh, you know, um, in Thailand, we would try to save costs as much as possible, mm. you know? So like the AC is always like the last resort. So that's like when we're literally like dying of heat stroke. Yeah. Any other time it's just like, come on, you can survive with a fan. So like I, yeah. I spent most of my like Thailand experience being cooled down by a fan and AC was just like, okay, if we don't put the AC on, we're probably going to die here. So it's, it's I, I think that's why it's like kind of nostalgic for me. Like mm. I, I kind of like the fan like I kind of like the feeling yeah, of the fan yeah. just just on me, but I admit, like, if you're not used to it, like, I felt sorry when you visited, you and Aki visited us in the UK because mm. you had to, <laughs> you, had to you had to sleep in my room, and we that was like there was one fan <clears> in there. That, there was a single fan in like my entire house, and like Joey, you can have the fan, <laughs> and I was like, I don't think it actually did anything for it you. Didn't do anything. <laughs> I was butt fucking naked in your bed. I'm like, I'm still dying. It sucks. Yeah, it it doesn't help and it doesn't get yeah. cool during the night. It's the fan, the, yeah, I get like the whole like fan being nostalgic though. Cause like I have that exact same thing at my oh, grandma's yeah, Suffering old. is nostalgic for me. No, I, at my, I love at, being at my grandma's old place in the middle of nowhere in the mountains. Yeah. yeah. We didn't have AC. It was just, a, cause the house was too big to have a single AC unit. Yeah. yeah. And like also all the doors were always open. So it was always with a fan. Yeah. But is it's nostalgic. Is it good memories though? No. <laughs> <laughs> My like 10 ah, years old. I love just dying yeah, slowly. God, yeah. so I, remember, I remember the time when I almost died of heat stroke <laughs> in my grandma's house. Good times. <laughs> no, but I, like, you might be confusing nostalgia with like PTSD. I like I like the feeling of, I like I prefer the heat, the feeling of summer over winter, like any day of the week. I, I, I cannot up, number two aspect. in public because I need my own private space. <laughs> <laughs> you can't go to the toilet in public? Number two. Why? I, I like, it's it's like a last resort, right? <laughs> <It's> what? <laughs> what? Why? Because because I want my own private space, right? I, I, wanna, what, I want- What are you doing? Are you shitting on the walls? He's making art. <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I don't want a time limit to how long I need to sit on you the toilet. To. Okay. Fuck them, they can wait. I don't give a shit. When I wave someone, I understand sometimes you, you, 
you have to take the time you take. Yeah. I'll complain about it if someone takes 10 minutes to shit. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. He can take 10 minutes to take a shit. <laughs> well, he doesn't want to be complained at. That's the point. I'm not going to complain I, I don't feel, I'm going to gonna... mutter under my breath when I sit down. Like, fuck, no, I, I don't want to just... feel pressured. You know, I, I, I hate it when I feel like just someone's don't feel waiting. pressured. Just don't, f- just you, don't feel pressured. You can't, it's not a see-through door. You can't see the fucking line. You're shitting. You're in your don't own Don't rush bubble. the artist oh, when he's come making come his on, art, all right? You, you, we've all been there. We've all been there. No, I don't. You're fucking desperate for the toilet and you're like, you, you're fucking searching for any public toilet you can. Yeah. Maybe you're in a Starbucks, maybe you're in a train station, yeah. right? And you go to this toilet and there's just this one guy mm. who's just taking three millennia. As much as, as much is as that like you every time? As no, much, no, that's, that's, it's that's, it's fucking him every I don't want to be that guy. That's why I'm just like, every, no, I'm, no, I'm doing it. Time, I, I, oh, there's gone again. I, I want to have a comfortable experience. And I understand that comes, it might take a little more time than I'd like. Right. I understand that comes with the fact that someone else is going to want a comfortable experience. I'm going to have to wait. Yeah. I don't give a shit. Literally, I don't. <laughs> I, I will. I will wait to give that shit. I. I will wait the five minutes, the ten minutes, whatever it be. Yeah. yeah I'll be like, oh, fuck's sake, why take so long? But you know, at the end of the day, I don't give a shit. <laughs> no, you actually genuinely take thirty minutes to shit. I don't think that's yeah. I, I. I actually you genuinely. I have. We, never, we get to the point in this office where I legitimately go. Where's, where's gone? gone? Yeah, we go. Where's gone? <laughs> and we realize he's been gone for thirty minutes. Did he go gone to the shops or something? No, no, no he's taking a shit. Okay, but like I'm actually, I'm, I'm not just sitting there for no reason. Okay, I don't. What, I don't, what part of this is take? Can you explain which aspect takes thirty minutes? I'm genuinely. Are you curious. performing like alchemy in there? Like, why is it taking so long? <laughs> I don't know. Some, sometimes, like, I just feel uncomfortable if I don't feel completely empty. <laughs> like, 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 I, I need to feel completely completely empty before I feel comfortable stopping the process, right? <laughs> that is the fucking stupidest shit. What are you talking about? Sometimes you're just not gonna empty up, man. You just gotta get on with your you're day. You're gonna be sitting go there, back you're literally gonna be sitting there all day. Just go back I, later. I am completely I, yeah. fine with that, oh, you know? Have you, have you not considered taking, like you don't have a limit to how many shits you can take a day, you know? Like you can, if you, you take a shit, you get up and you go, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm just come back about later. About an hour later, you're like, oh, I'm yeah. a bit full again. You can go back. Yeah, but it's, unlike it's, it's, video games, you can pause. You yeah, can yeah, come why, back. Why do you have to like, why do you have to have be like, this is the only shit I can take for the day. Yeah, I'm going right. to empty out when I can. Okay, okay. Yeah. Like, 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 it's like- You're not the, a dog. You, you've <laughs> nerfed man. yourself. Huh? You've, you've nerfed yourself. How have I nerfed myself? I, I have that feeling, right? Where I'm not fully empty. I'm like, yeah. Shogunai, get on with the day, man. I'll come back later and finish I take like job. two to three shits a day on average. Yeah, me too, me too. Just because like, I know, like I'm just like in and out. If I'm still full, it's all right. I'll be back in an hour. You can tell within like two pushes if it's coming or not. Like, <laughs> oh, no, you do not like, need you to wait. You don't have to strain that shit. You're like, you're, you do not need to wait. You're, you're, you're depraving a good fucking experience. Bro, your, okay. a, your, I'm ass, sorry, mu- I'm- your ass muscle is probably the strongest so- fucking thing in existence. <laughs> the amount you've probably worked that thing out is probably insane. I, I'm, you I'm, could I'm probably fuck- crush someone's head in, with your anus, man. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you know, I'm I'm a, I'm a, I'm a fucking say it. Sometimes the shits are the highlights of the day. No. Like, 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 like some, sometimes you just Need a fucking escape from are you, the world? Are you okay? Like, are your days okay? <laughs> I want days are fucking good, man. <laughs> I after after, after, I after a good shit, are you are you kidding me? Sometimes you just need to just escape don't... from your man cave. I... You just need to go on your Twitter. You, like, like I just imagine it. He's just eight hours in the Starbucks, fucking vein bursting in his head. He's like, I gotta go and shit, but I gotta go home. I can't do it here. It's gonna take one hour. <laughs> just a black hole is yeah. forming in his asshole. Man. Boneless or bone? Bone. Boneless. No. Boneless, boneless, man. I'm a boneless kind of guy, man. I'm a boneless kind of guy. Get that bone out of there. If I can't I, eat it, get it out of my face. Sometimes I just don't want to go through the process of being like a fucking Thank animal you. and tearing this shit Thank limb you. from it limb. Tastes I'm better. not. I just no, want it to taste nothing, no. better. You're, 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 better. You're, like, you're like you trying are, to play Doom Eternal with this chicken. What shit are you talking about? Well. What are you talking about? I don't want to If I gave you two plates, one of them came from a bone chicken, one of them came from a boneless chicken, you would not be able to tell a fucking difference. You would not. You would not. I would. You Guarantee you will not be able to sound like Maylene right now. The moisture, <laughs> the moisture is there. It's it's more no. natural flavor no. of the chicken. No, no, it no. tastes the You're texture. Full of shit. The texture is better You're as full well. Of shit. Everything is better the on a bone chicken. You, you the sometimes only thing, get the veiniest motherfuckers that <laughs> the, the only pumping thing, steroids into these chickens. The only thing that is de- <laughs> that is a detriment is the fact that is a bone chicken. But that's a ha- I will happily pay the price for a better tasting chicken. It's like I don't appreciate ninety percent of 
of bread because to me, ninety percent of bread tastes the fucking same. You know, that's but it's like when, okay, when I'm I, a, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to you, get you to stop right here. You bro. cannot say. I was that. on your side until you said that. <laughs> that's like that's like me going, bro. Every fucking rice and noodle is the fucking same, yeah, bro. Yeah. Like it's like that's just yeah. Udon is exactly the same as bro, fucking noodle shit, bro. Yeah. It's like no different from instant noodles, bro. Yeah. It's ninety percent the same. Like, okay, you know? it's like ninety percent of the ramen noodles. Well, I didn't think you could be racist towards white people, but in that moment, <laughs> I think you genuinely were. I think that was actually racist towards white people, bro. That French, was like, French people clutching their baguettes right now. French, bro, Germans are losing it right now. That's <laughs> half of German food, man. Dude, you, I, we gotta do a trash taste special where we just take Gant to a German bakery and he just is like, what the fuck? I didn't know you could have 15 different types are of you pretzels. Saying, okay, yeah, are you saying that a pretzel tastes the same as a baguette? It's pretzel bread? Oh, what? <laughs> Gone, what? <laughs> yes, it's bread. I what? Not, not the little fucking hard, like cookie-esque uh, ones. It's like, like, like an like, actual like pretzels. fucking- A pretzel. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna be honest. Okay. <laughs> what are you about to say, <laughs> God? I'm gonna be honest. A pretzel to me is just a salted baguette. That's, no! kind of, that's what That's what it tastes no! like to me. Right? What? That's that's kind of what it tastes what? like to me. What? Okay. <laughs> like to to me, to me, bread. Whoa. Okay, to me, I <laughs> to me, I can't I can't eat this bread. This is how World War Three began. <laughs> to me, I I can't eat bread by itself a lot of times. It needs to be what? flavored. Okay. It needs to have some butter on it. Like I, <laughs> for example, a baguette, I need some butter with that baguette a lot of the times. Okay. Pretzels, they have salt. Okay. No, you can't just eat a baguette. Like a good baguette. With butter? No, just just a baguette. Just eat it by you itself. Can't, I, I can't fucking eat a baguette by itself. That's just like- You've just lost all of your audience this episode, yeah. Gaunt. You like won the Italians and then threw them away. What the fuck, Gaunt? Even the, Ita- no, no, no. Even, even the Italians serious? are doing this right now. Okay. You're going on a European tour. No, no, because like, because, fucking because actually like, like, okay, Europe. okay with, with the crust, <laughs> you know, with the crust, you're not eating, you know, it's not like you have the pizza part with the cheese and, you know, and the toppings and everything. And then you have the crust part, right? That's a very small ratio to the whole pizza itself. I can't eat a pizza sized crust, no matter how good like Bro, the I fucking stone baked crust I is. I can just chow down on a whole baguette, like straight oh, out when easy. it's when it's good quality. Like I don't need Pretzel anything. as well. Yeah, like if it's if it's lightly salted, it's Oh, don't even don't even need. I don't think with you've that. had good bread, gone. Genuinely, yeah. I think you. If you <sighs> if you had fresh bread, like good bread, I think you change your. No, mind. Fresh bread is good, but like like not like I, fucking Tesco bread. No, 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 no. I've, I've I've had fresh bread, but f- bread to me what, is what like fresh bread. Hmm? I'm, I'm I'm skeptical now. Where have you had this fresh bread? Okay, so you you go oh, you, you had, go. You, you had fresh bread yesterday. No, that was that was fucking yeah. great. Could I eat more than just the slice that we got? No. What? That was that was too much, and with the slice, you know, I, I fucking I'm gonna I, destroy that whole plate. I could, no, I could, yeah, it, I could like, have that. That's plate. like way every too time heavy. I go to an Italian okay, okay. restaurant in I've America. Had, I've had okay. many meals where okay. I have enjoyed the bread, like a, an amount where honestly, if the rest of my food yeah. didn't come out, I would be happy. Yeah, with every the time plate I go to an Italian restaurant in America, and they always give you that like the plate of bread, I'm just like more. I need yeah. more. This bread, is not gonna okay. be enough. Bread to me is a starter. It is a starter. It is not the meal. You can't just have bread as a meal. This right? man would not. I don't have know who I'm offending with. This take right now, but to me, the, I can't, entire, the entire Middle yeah. Ages. I, I, I can't <laughs> just have peasants in the 1800s. I, I, can't just, I can't just have like pure bread as a meal. I'm pretty sure, like, if, if you, you were born in the 1700s in Europe, you would be so dead. I, I didn't think we were gonna have another <laughs> like, food bread episode, but like, for dinner. <laughs> what the fuck? fuck is no, 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 no. I feel like right. You no, guys no, okay. made such. You guys made such a big fucking deal about this pizza thing that I didn't think it was a big deal. And, hey, and, and don't this, and this, man, this shit, and this man walks in here being like, bread is shit. <laughs> okay, okay, like straight up. Like okay. what? Okay. Like you don't, you don't even have like a gluten allergy or something or some <laughs> shit like that to like hide behind. I didn't it. say bread was shit. I said bread is not a meal. You said ninety percent of bread, and I quote, tastes the same. Okay, and no- I- okay, I'm gonna go back on that yeah. statement. Okay, <laughs> you 90, better recap. Ninety percent of bread does not taste the same. How much but, percent? Huh? How much percent? But I mean, like, <laughs> like an eighty-seven. <laughs> Name a percent. Gone. Okay. With bread, I can't have bread as a meal. That's like having pure rice as a meal, okay? No, it's as totally, as, no, as an Asian, no. I can't just have rice as a meal. I know people can just have rice as a meal, but you need no, some you need it's some different. fucking seasoning on the rice, it's you know? You need to, you need so some different. flavoring. You need something to go with the rice I, I, because cockroaches can come. And I realized I think cereal is better without milk. Oh god, he said it. <laughs> Oh, he said it. And I'm I'm 50-50 on this. He said one. it. Oh. I like it with and without. And I remember I remember I, I remember just eating one day and I just said it casually to Sydney. Uh, and she looked at me like I just murdered someone. <laughs> she just dropped the spoon. <laughs> she dropped the spoon in the milk. Is that really that bad of a take? 
I mean, apparently it is. Um, I like, you know, Weetabix in the UK as a kid, I used to just eat those dry. I think- cause no, I, I can understand that because when you put that in milk, it just turns into wet cardboard. Yeah. yeah. But like, I think it's better without milk. I, th I, th oh, I think that's I think that's what angers people. It's my mood, you know? Some days I want, cause you know, it's a fucking challenge having to eat cereal without milk. It is. It's like- <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's like you're eating you're eating Scooby snacks. That's but like, like your dental is. workout is insane. <laughs> but like I I hate it when you pour the milk in, okay, mm. and then the timer starts because just it, pour less than you just need. pour less milk. I just pour less than I need. How much milk are you putting in? I mean, he's, I'm he's putting in the normal in. amount of milk, but it's well, clearly you're not. You're, you're not. <laughs> yeah, it's getting wet. <laughs> well, it's getting soggy. I hate soggy well, cereal. You should put a little bit in and then mix it like force it through the milk. There's but a I, technique. But I also think that waters it down as well. You're having like cinnamon crunch or something. And then you, I, I want the cinnamon on the crunch. I want the crunch and the cinnamon together. But like you put the <laughs> milk in- Wouldn't putting more milk water it down. Hmm? Wouldn't putting more milk water it down. Yeah. No, that, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I don't, so saying, I don't want any milk in there. Cause I like the taste of cereal as it is. But if you just put a little bit of milk, just to wet it, yeah, just to wet it. it, 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 of, it yeah, it, it like brings out I, the flavor. I literally put like the bare minimum milk if I do. And then I just, Keep like rinsing it through the milk. Yeah, that's exactly what I do. So that by the time you finish it, you only have like yeah, a tiny yeah, yeah. pool of milk. Do you at think the it tastes better with the milk in it though? Well, yeah, I, I just because most of the time when it's no milk, I'm like tired by the end of eating it. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not that I not that I really eat cere a lot of cereal anymore, but yeah. yeah, every time I do feel like a cereal like I, bowl, I, I, I just yeah, it's it's with I, milk. I, I, I'm not a fan of katsudon. Really? Like, because it's like to me, to me, <laughs> what? to me, part of my like one of my favorite things about tonkatsu is the texture, right? But when yeah. you put it under egg, it just like, it gets rid of that crunch to it. It's no, like, but like it's, re I, I, but I, I, that's I, I, replaced I, I, with the <laughs> fucking amazing like egg and like pork flavor. I like the crunch. I, I, I think all I that like uni turns your brain the goop, bro. No, don't, 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 don't put them in the same category. About, bro. What the fuck? Like it's, it's that crunch, it's that fresh crunch that just, it's it's just godly. And by putting egg over it- If you get a fresh one, you can get like the crunch with the egg and the sauce and the- You gotta, you gotta, you have the cuts on it. My sin, dude. It has the crunch. Oh, I can't believe you just. Tell you what that. it is. I can't believe you. Tell you what. Tell you what it is. It's it's like putting milk in your cereal, no, right? Fuck. <laughs> it's like I, I you prefer, get rid, you I get rid of the texture. You, I like that crunch. I, I like I, that I think fresh katsudon, crunch. Katsudon is better than the normal uh, just katsu because you, you get the egg, the egg and the onions are a game changer. But yes. with the rice, because when you get the perfect ratio of of meat, egg, rice, and onions in one bite. Oh. It's like it's like Food Wars level God, of like so nothing. Dude. It's it's the best. God. I don't know what Gaunt's talking about. Gaunt's a little baby though. Gaunt's like, dude, Gaunt asks questions like, do you peel your crayons before you eat it? Like, that's what it, like I don't, don't, don't trust Gaunt with his no, opinions. No. I mean, I mean, it's 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 a it's a pre it's a preference thing. It's a preference. Of thing. course. To, to me, to me, the best thing about tonkatsu yeah, is that fucking to eat shit. Is that fucking that's what you do. No, 